Mazar Mohamed Saleh, financial advisor to Prime Minister Mohamed Shia al Sudani, ruled out the delay in instructions for implementing the federal budget schedules for the year 2024, Saleh told Al Farat News Agency. I do not think that the instructions for implementing the federal general budget, according to the financial schedules related to the fiscal year 2024, which were recently approved by the House of Representatives, will take a long time to be issued. He noted that the basic instructions for implementing the budget that were issued regarding the tripartite budget, issued under Law No. 13 of 2023 and currently in effect, are sufficient and effective. But perhaps there are some adaptations that require some amendments or additions to the instructions in force and in accordance with the requirements of the country's financial situation, which is a matter facilitator at the Federal Ministries of Finance and Planning. On June the 3rd, the House of Representatives voted to approve the schedules of the Federal General Budget Law 2024 after making amendments to a number of expenditure schedules and financial allocations for the development of the governorates. The total financial budget amounted to 211.9 trillion diners, equivalent to more than $153 billion, an increase of 7% over the current year's budget, and employee salaries, including 60 to trillion diners, a significant difference from last year, which amounted to about 50. 9 trillion diners. The general revenues of the Iraqi state, according to the budget, amount to about 145 trillion diners, which means recording a deficit of 66 trillion. The government says it will reduce the difference in the deficit from high oil prices. One of the most prominent amendments to the current budget that was subject to scrutiny in Parliament's Finance Committee is granting the government the authority to transfer funds between ministries, as well as various investment amounts for service and infrastructure projects throughout the country's cities. It became clear that the cost of public operating spending in the country had increased, as the total salaries of employees rose from 59-point to 63-point for trillion diners, an increase of 4-point to trillion diners, and the cost of care networks and government subsidies rose from 24.5 to 26.9 trillion diners, an increase of 2.4 trillion diners.